Alright, man. Torture talk. You know what it is. Like, share, subscribe to the page. You know what it is. Alright, man. Let's get into this. 6 9 drops a new song. Punani. Alright, man. So let's go on. Let's let's just be let's just kick this just let's just get this out the way. I don't care about 6ix9ine's antics. I don't care about who he snitched on and ratting. I'm just gonna put that out there. That's not my main concern. My main concern is the music. And I'll be honest with you. Creatively, 6ix9ine is one of the best right now. Now, I'm gonna say this. Creatively, not bar wise, not uh, uh, um, song content, but just creatively how he uses the songs. Every one of his songs to me stands out that he dropped so far. Every one of them stands out to the point where I kind of like a lot of them and they stand out. Now, is he spitting bars? No. Is he, is he, does he have crazy content? No. But the thing that I can say that every one of these songs doesn't sound like any other song that's out. I like what he's doing. You know what I'm saying? I think that 6 9 should keep going with what he's doing. I think that um, the whole antics and, the, and, and all that stuff, that's a part of him, whatever. I don't care for that. You know what I'm saying? I'm not, into, I'm not here to review his life story. I'm here to review the music. So I'm not going to speak on the whole everything he did. So from now on, from on, here on out, you're not going to hear me talk about that. I'm not going to talk about that. You know what I'm saying? You're not going to hear me say anything about that. But I'm going to get into it. All right, so there's only one song, Hunani. You know, he proving a point or making a point. He's riding around, riding around New York City, calling everybody pussies, in a, basically in a way. You know what I'm saying? And I think that that in itself is kind of weird and funny to me. You know what I'm saying? It's just funny. And on top of that, he is an excellent promoter. He knows how to promote his music. He knows what he's doing. He's not gonna just go out here and just say, oh yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna just rap. No, everything he puts out, it seems to stream and seems to do very well. And I think that um, he's gonna keep doing well because he know how to keep himself the center of attention. You know, as far as the song goes, um, the, lyrics, the lyrics was okay. It wasn't something I thought that uh, was groundbreaking. You know what I'm saying? Some of the stuff I thought was kind of like generic. You know what I'm saying? I was like, okay, yeah, that, that was it. But then you have uh, the uh, the mix was very good. I thought the mix was good. Instrumentation was amazing to me. I think that his instrumentation um, in his last couple of songs is who's ever doing his production? They ain't really, they really working this right now. He has a lot of songs, and if this is gonna be his album, there's a lot of bangers on this album. Like every one of them songs, I would say, can probably be played somewhere and people would fuck with it. If 6 9 didn't have a lot of stuff looming over his head, he clearly would be one of the biggest artists out right now, which it, which he is right now, but he has a lot of ocean over his head. So I gave this song a, a, a strong seven, uh, pushing up to an eight. Um, I liked it. I liked uh, what he's doing. I think 6 9 is a, a creative monster, and I think that he has a creative mind when it comes to music. And don't be surprised if he don't do something or go out, out the box and do something that's like really really crazy sooner or later that's probably not even rap you know what i'm saying so six nine tell me what y'all think about the song like share subscribe to the page you know what it is torture talk uh hit the bell you know make sure y'all notified i'll be back later with some more reviews you know what it is torture talk